Now, of course, this looks a bit messy with all of these helpful guides around, and sometimes I like to see what it really will look like in the browser. Pressing the live button helps a little bit because it gets rid of the split view, but actually even better is to preview it in a browser, and that's what I'm going to do. So I've previewed in the browser, and it's supposed to be centered. I'm wondering why is it over to the left here? Well, possibly it's because the size of my page is too big, that it's actually bigger than the size of my little laptop. So I'm going to change some of the parameters. I click on the style icon, and that shows me the style sheet. And if I change this to, say, 800, just to test, and then I'm going to save all. Now I'm going to refresh my page in the browser. I pressed F5, which is the shortcut for reloading the page. And you can see now that the container is probably about this wide, going from here to here, and we can see it is in fact centered. So I'm going to go back to my page, change the parameters back to what it was before, save it, and this time I'm going to just press Control plus S on my keyboard to save that. I go back to this section. Okay, so that's how I check whether the wrapper is correctly inserted or not.